Now, isn't that a nice smallmouth? Look at that. Now he hit really hard. The one thing that I love about smallmouth bass is the way they get these tiger stripes. Now, you know, on our website at Ask Italo, I had someone just ask me recently, what's the best way to identify a large mouth and a small mouth? I'll give you the tip right now. You see this dorsal fin? On a small mouth, it looks like one continuous fin. See how even here, there's about a quarter inch to half inch of fin? On a large mouth, that front dorsal goes down and literally ends at the back and then the second one starts again, okay? So a lot of guys say, oh, you know, look for a small mouth. Well, I've got large mouth with small mouths and small mouths with big mouths. So the best ID feature is right here, okay? So this is definitely a small mouth because this fin is all connected. If the fin looked like it was two different ones, it would be a large mouth. Beautiful fish. Just going to get him back in the water. He's in the net and perfect.